Tonight, Providence schools say they'll make counselors available following the tragic drowning of a student. We're told the team was swimming in Whiting Pond in North Attleboro when he disappeared. His body was found hours later. Eyewitness News reporter Sheena Loshudo joins us live from North Attleboro with new reaction at 6. Sheena. Shannon, the call at first came in for a missing swimmer. We were here last night as several agencies were searching, and now we're learning the victim is from Rhode Island. There's no words that can explain. Flowers from a complete stranger lie at the entrance of Whiting's Pond. The note sending sympathy to Jonathan Lozada's family. The Bristol County District Attorney's Office identified him as the 16-year-old boy pulled out of the water in North Attleboro. He was pronounced dead around 7 o'clock on Sunday night. I would say maybe 30 people here yesterday and uh, I stayed here for a couple hours. Maria says she left the pond shortly before the rescue began. I'm just wondering how, you know, the question mark, how. We've learned Lozada lived and went to school in Providence. The school district sent us a statement reading, the Providence public school community is tremendously saddened by the sudden passing of Juanita Sanchez educational complex student, Jonathan Lozada, and we send our deepest sympathy to his family and friends. We are making counselors and community health professionals available upon request to members of the JSEC community. I'm very sorry for the family, you know, it's very sad. So young and just no other words, you know, may God comfort their heart. And crews were searching here for about two hours before they discovered the body. We're told the water here is muddy, and that was a challenge for first responders. I'm Sheena Loshudo, Eyewitness News.